AMC theaters say they're now banning costumes or masks in their theaters. But how far do businesses need to go to protect customers? And how much security is too much? San Diego 6's Nancy Aziz reports. 9-11 brought us here. Courtroom shootings now mean metal detectors in courthouses. Tomlinson, left side. Inside. Violence at games translates into this. Extra screening at the queue. Now many wondering, will a Colorado massacre lead to more changes in our daily lives? What's going to happen? Have a security guard or a policeman at front of each door and each public places? SDSU business management expert Wendy Patrick says businesses likely will need to analyze many factors when deciding how much security to add. Businesses are going to be weighing the same kinds of things they weigh traditionally. Money, manpower, and public safety first and foremost. She says economics will prevent all venues from instituting large-scale security measures like metal detectors. She says some might rely on low-tech methods. One of the things you hear people talking about is is uh, training, more training in what to look for. In Israel, citizens are used to tight security everywhere they go. Some are asking, is that what we want here in malls, movie theaters, theme parks? I don't want to live in a society like that. It's really sad that, it, you know, like the airports and other places like that have come to that. So I, I wouldn't mind the metal detectors personally. Even if the theater in Colorado had metal detectors, it's not clear they would have stopped the gunman. Experts will surely be examining what, if anything, could. Nancy Aziz, San Diego 6 News. So what should you do if you're in an area where...